A man has escaped a burning boat seconds before it was fully consumed by flames. The cabin cruiser was destroyed in minutes. The blaze took hold dangerously fast. That's, it's a huge problem. Fueled by petrol and plastic, it took 20 firefighters and a team of volunteers to get it under control. A worker from the Coburn Powerboat Association was starting the vessel around 9am this morning. One engine started, but firing the second sparked an explosion. The man still on board grabbed a fire extinguisher. Unfortunately, the fire extinguisher did expire. Um, we ran out of um, powder and um, was unable to find a um, second extinguisher and the fire then ignited further. Another man just nearby helped him off the boat just in time. Seconds later, the vessel was engulfed. You didn't do anything to it? No, but... I'm very fortunate he wasn't injured and that's probably the most important thing about the whole exercise. This is all that was left of the 35-foot cabin cruiser. Coburn Sea Rescue tried to tow the wreckage away, but it sunk to the bottom. The cruiser's owner was on the shore when the boat went up in flames. It was worth about $50,000 pretty distraught and obviously it's his pride and joy. Um, it hasn't had it very long apparently, so very disappointed. When the boat caught fire, it was tied up to the floating jetty behind me. The ropes burnt through and it moved away, but not soon enough. There's $80,000 damage to the jetty. To move the boat now will require a crane. It's believed a fuel leak caused the engine to explode. Alice Pauley, Nine News.